Hey guys, I'm Martin Fenska and welcome to another of my Part of Exile crafting videos. Uh, as usual, we'll be alking some jewelry. I have um, a full tab of rings and uh, here I have a tab of amulets, so we'll alk all of this, go through all the rolls, and while we go through the rolls, I'll try to sort out items that uh, uh, are not rolled well enough, and I'll use them for vendor recipes, so we'll go, uh, or at least I'll try to do some of the prismatic ring recipes, and... Uh, the transmit recipe with um, Ember Jade and Lapis Amulet. So I think we should get around 320 rolls in this video. That's a lot of uh, work we have ahead. So let's start. Uh, first we'll unlock everything and then we'll just see what we get. Okay, so those were rings, now amulets, let's first alk everything and then we will work with it further. Okay, so everything's alt. So let's uh, go through those rolls and what we're gonna need um, uh, from uh, rings. I think I'll just do uh, the prismatic ring recipe. So I just have to focus more on um, all those, all these two stone rings. Okay, so let's start. Um, uh, that can go into the recipe. Same here. This is high life highlighting resist, so that will sell. Uh, this can go into the recipe. Oh, same here. Noth come on. Nothing. Strength, uh, average, dual res. The cold is uh, very decent, and both cold and lightning resist. Um, are actually pretty good when you add it to the implicit role, so I think this will sell easily. Uh, this is garbage, um, nice strength and uh, nothing else. Garbage, mana region, some lightning rest, decent intellect, uh, this is like a chaos maybe. Garbage, garbage, eh. Not good enough. Garbage. This is basically just average life with nothing. Nothing. This is horrible. Okay. Nothing. Wow, so far it's pretty bad. Uh, good mana, decent decks and intervals. Uh, the cold damage is just uh, a joke, but um, maybe because of the dex and this may sell for a chaos. I'll probably try. Most likely, it's not gonna sell, but uh, uh, it's probably worth it a try. Not much. Ah, come on. Not on this one. Not much to see here. 
uh, fire res with some fire damage, but um, yeah, this. So we'll go into the recipe as well. Um, nothing. Nothing. Cast speed with nothing, basically. Never mind. Lightning, a bit of fly, a bit of strength. Lightning res, accuracy. This is probably a chaos. So let's try that. Um, nothing. Come on. Nothing here or here. Decent dexterity with nothing else. Um, very average life, some mana. Average gold dress. This is like a chaos, probably. So let's try. Uh, nothing here or here. Uh, this is just the dexterity, basically. So let's get rid uh, rid of that as well. And um, uh, yeah, tier two dexterity, tier two evasion. But uh, those rolls, especially the evasion, really is not something that would make the make a ring. Okay, so those are gone. Uh, Nothing here. Uh, decent accuracy, some lightning damage, a bit of fist damage. Uh, I'd probably try this for a chaos. Bit of fly, fleech, some resist. Yeah, I think a chaos maybe for someone who is leveling. Um, i probably try it, but it's, everything is pretty horrible so far. Uh, here we have three base, all three base stats. Uh, though all rolls are either average or actually bad. That int is very low. Bit of rarity, decent life. This will sell. Uh, three, four chaos maybe. Uh, good accuracy, good lightning res, and nothing else. But it still should sell. It still can mastercraft something. Uh, what do we have here? Fire damage is uh, bad. Accuracy is pretty good with uh, decent energy shield. Uh, tier 1 all res with some life gain on hit. This is actually decent ring for some CI build or hybrid build. It's not that bad. Okay, this is a couple of chaos definitely. This is a quite decent ring I'd say. Uh, this is significantly worse so let's get rid of that. This is garbage. Uh, okay, fist damage, and that's basically it. Yeah, okay, let's get rid of that. Lightning damage with nothing. Good fist damage with nothing. Ah, oh, come on. Fist damage, cast speed, uh, not really good enough. Um, some mana, decent energy shield. Bit of mana regeneration that's average. I'll have to check this one. Can it roll something? And if it can, what the, would that be? Okay, it can't roll more um, more uh, increased rarity, but it can roll life. And this will probably sell. Not too much, but uh, it's where it uh, where it's selling. Okay, what about this? Um, very average those base stats, uh, very average lightning, just the mana is decent, that's not enough. Okay, so that's uh, this and uh, from now on we'll just go through those rolls because uh, I'll keep even the uh, bad rolls here for um, uh, real recipe. Let's see, average stats, uh, okay -ish accuracy, some life, uh, high mana, a few chaos, fire accuracy, life, energy shield, some resist, uh, mm, a few chaos again, it's not that bad, but nothing amazing. Oh, garbage, horrible, fire damage accuracy, horrible, lightning, mana region strength, uh, very, very bad, but maybe for someone running CI because of that strength, it could work. It has the lightning, lightning rest is not that bad. Yeah, probably like a chaos or two. Uh, 
cold resist and life are amazing. The fire damage, uh, why not? Dexterity and fist damage. It would be better if they were not there at all. But definitely soluble. Once there is a high life and th at least one good uh, resist, uh, it's always soluble. And this is on the sapphire base, which means uh, it's like how much? Uh, 60, 71 cold res on the ring. So for someone who is looking for. To improve his cold resist, this is definitely uh, quite valuable. So why not? Here we have 43 rarity with mana leech, some fire res, and mana regeneration. This is definitely sellable. Um, this is not that bad. The problem is that now when they're under various and winter's ring, uh, all the yellow rarity ring have. Uh, pretty good competition so they're not as good as they used to be but still I think this is uh, this is easily sellable for a couple of chaos mm, a bit of life mana energy shield some all res uh, chaos or two this is garbage uh, not much to see here or here. Wow, that fist damage and fire damage. Wow. Uh, garbage, of course. Uh, decent int. Uh, okay, sh energy shield. There is the chaos res. A bit of lightning damage. Sellable. Nothing amazing, but definitely sellable. Uh, some rarity leech. Mana accuracy is bad. Int is average. Not much to see here, really. Um, Evasion, life, fire, lightning, rest. Too bad it's for level 57. If it was for a lower level, it would be better. Um, but still, probably chaos. Next, int rarity. Can this roll maybe higher rarity? Of course not. Mm, I was thinking that the. Uh, because of the high int and okay-ish dexterity. For someone this um, could be useful if it could roll uh, more rarity, but uh, yeah, can't, so it's bad. Um, some lightning res with life, maybe a chaos. Uh, it's actually level 40, so maybe someone for leveling can take this. It's um, 36 lightning res together, so I'll probably try a chaos. Uh, fizz damage, a bit of accuracy, all res, uh, not much to see here. Accuracy evasion, uh, not enough. Some life, a bit of rarity. Oh, yeah, those rolls are just too low. Fizz rarity, same here, way too low rolls. Accuracy, mana, chaos res, uh, basically just chaos res with uh, uh, not much else. Nothing here. Dexterity. Uh, there's nothing here either. All res. Okay, fire damage, some accuracy, mana region. But uh, I don't know. Maybe chaos. It is that all res. I mean, all attributes, but that's a uh, low roll. Not even sure if it's worth uh, trying for a chaos. Probably not. Maybe, maybe I'll try, but I uh, don't think so. Okay, not much to see here. Would it be enough for someone uh, running CI or a hybrid build? Probably not. Int all attributes. Not of, that's a lot of int on the ring, but I don't think it's worth it. Nothing. 78 life, 16 all res. Okay, once you have these two rolls on the ring, uh, it's sellable. Uh, the rest... That evasion is actually tier 2, but yeah, evasion on the ring uh, usually doesn't add much value. Accuracy is average, some rarity. Uh, someone will definitely buy it, but... Uh, I don't know. 7 chaos, maybe something like that. Strength, that's a lot of strength, decent life, too bad that uh, all resist is so bad and life getting killed is horrible, but still sellable. 
uh, ES or S fire code, uh, decent resist, that's a lot of fire res on this together when you add all of this uh, 67, uh, 74 fire res and a bit of um, cold and lightning. Again, where the chaos are too. Can this add rarity? Nope. Okay. I may try this for a chaos, but don't think it's gonna sell. Uh, what do we have here? Attack speed and cast speed on one ring. Well, that uh, won't work. Some rarity. I don't think this uh, this can sell. Uh, accuracy energy shield, that's horrible that energy shield and way too low rolls. Nothing here. Nothing. Garbage. Uh, decent life. But in this case, actually it's for level 35, so maybe just because it's level 35, this may sell for a chaos, someone will take it for leveling, or maybe I will keep it for myself for leveling. Uh, high life leveling ring is always useful when it's on a resistance base. Um, yeah. So at least something from that. I'll most likely end up just using it for myself for leveling. A uh, bit of fist damage, fire damage, mana cold. Uh, I don't think it's gonna sell. Nothing to see here or here. Uh, this is a bit better. That's uh, decent phase uh, and lightning. They're actually very nice rolls. Um, okay, it's lightning resist, a bit of rarity. Too bad the rarity isn't higher. Uh, this will definitely sell. This is not that bad. Couple of chaos. Life mana mana region, energy shield, all attributes. Again, sellable. Couple of chaos. Nothing amazing. Attack speed, high life. Um, Okay, fire resist, evasion is just a wasted roll, but again, sellable couple of chaos. Strength, dex, fire damage, nothing to see here. Uh, this is a lot of numbers on it, but uh, all of them are bad or won't make the ring useful. So let's move on. This is just horrible. Um, this would be a nice ring if um, uh, we get higher rolls. So, never mind. This is a bit better. Too bad that those damage rolls are so low. If they were higher, like tier 3, that would be a pretty good ring. But, well, it will sell for like 2 3 chaos. Not much to see here. Fierce, elemental damage, bit of accuracy, some Auris call damage. It's a decent weapon, elemental damage, um, with a bit of uh, other things. Maybe chaos or two. Uh, it can add quite a bit of damage. It might sell, but not sure about that. But I'll try. Not much to see here. Um, uh, it's just uh, a lot of int and nothing else, so never mind. Um, not good enough. Fist strength, mana rarity, um, garbage as well. This is just horrible. Nothing. Fist cold, accuracy, evasion, uh, nothing here. Uh, cold lightning, all res. Um, too bad it doesn't have life. Uh, when you have coral rings and um, don't don't roll at least average life on them, it usually is not um, that useful. You know, if someone goes for a coral 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 ring, it's because uh, he needs a lot of life. So he needs the implicit and life rolled on the ring. So even though there is the damage, there is a decent cold, cold rest without that life. Eh, maybe chaos. Um, not much to see here. 
come on, now we need those high life rolls. Where, where are they? This is horrible. Uh, rarity, this is bad. Uh, that's a low life, very low life. All these rolls are low. Level 35. Is it even worth trying? Probably not. This is just too bad. Again, nothing here. Nothing. What about this? So, uh, if it was uh, 67 life and not 67 mana, then okay. But in this case, uh, just bad. 57 life with some fist damage and nothing else. I don't think this can sell. 60 life. Okay, mana region, but the rest is horrible. So never mind again. Life, mana, mana region. No. Even if you get the life, the rest is just so bad that uh, it uh, will never sell. This is a bit better. Um, though the life is still pretty bad. There is the dexterity, and usually people who are looking for coral rings and need the dexterity on them or need dexterity somewhere, so that adds some value. Nice cold dress. This is like, I don't know, 2 3 chaos. 72 life with 27 lightning rest, that's basically all this is. And because it's for level 35, it's enough. Maybe a second ring I'll keep for leveling. Uh, fizz and cast speed, and nothing else, so never mind. 2 res, uh, average, 2 damage rolls, average, no life, so nothing there. Here is double rarity roll uh, with some life. Uh, maybe someone who is starting some kind of magic finder will buy this for a chaos or two. Don't really think that can happen, but I'll try. Um, nothing and nothing to see here. Okay, diamond rings. Some base stats with fire ass. It's a strength and dexterity. Uh, that's actually not that bad with decent fire res. Uh, this will sell, not not amazing, but 2-3 uh, uh, chaos probably. Fire damage accuracy, bit of rarity, no, 2-4-6, no, this is uh, not gonna work. A uh, bit of life, evasion, again, not good enough. Dexterity, energy shield, all rest and cold resist. Uh, for a CI crit build, someone who is starting that build, you know, between level 60 65, this could be the first string you, you take with you to, to first maps. Uh, there is the dexterity that uh, those builds usually uh, need. Some ES, uh, decent resistances for a, for a you know, the, the starting ring. That uh, may work. Uh, this is a chaos at best, but most likely no one will need this. Uh, nothing to see here or here. Mm, rolls are not high enough. This is intelligence and chaos rest. Those are good, but the rest is just, just horrible. So those two rolls won't save it. Um, nothing here. Nothing here. This looks... Yeah, first two rolls look good. But uh, the fire and chaos rests are really a joke. So still the life and all rest will sell the ring. So, those were rings. And um, let's assist? actually um, finish those rings. Again, trying to go after 10%. Oh, come on. So let's try to change these. Come on. 
there is 10 percent uh, I think I'll have to keep this one and that's the last one Okay, <laughs> rings, let's throw this into the regal tab already. And you may as well identify this immediately when we are in this tab. Uh, energy shield with basically 25 all res. I'll try this for some CI or hybrid build. Don't think this will sell, but oh, oh maybe chaos or two. What about this? So um, that's not good enough. Not really. Nope. Nope. This accuracy mana call just too bad that um, it's not life instead of mana. Maybe because this is on prismatic base, it's could sell for like a chaos. Uh, life mana rarity. This is a bit better. There is okay -ish life, fist damage, int. That int gives some value to it. Um, this is bad. Okay. Where was the tab with the rest? Here. And amulets should be in this tab. So let's see these. Uh, Cast speed. That's a nice crit multiplier. Is this enough? Uh, not really. Fist dex crit chance. Uh, that fist uh, is very low. But there is the dexterity with crit chance. Maybe I'll try this for a chaos. 85 life with 20% armor will sell the ring, especially on the on the intellect base with all those marauders around now. I can go for maybe even like seven chaos, something like that. The accuracy and uh, mana on kill are just completely useless on the, on the amulet, so it's basically we are selling the life and armor, but those rolls are pretty nice. So that will sell uh, spell damage, very low spell damage, and nothing else. Uh, spell damage, energy shield, not enough. Garbage, garbage. Uh, what about this? Uh, this is not that bad. It's uh, decent rarity, and. Um, uh, rare amulets definitely don't have so much competition as rare rings, so you know, when we are talking about uh, uniques. So 37 rarity with two other decent rolls and average accuracy, that will sell definitely. Crit chance, strength, armor... Eh, eh. Don't really think this can sell. Maybe I'll try for a chaos. Very low fizz, crit chance with all res, uh, maybe a chaos. Uh, armor life, not good enough. 27 all res, and there it ends. I mean, 27 all attributes, of course, and there it ended. Crit chance, fire res, a little bit of strength, very low fizz damage. Nope, not good enough. Come on, nothing here. Armor, lightning, res, uh, nothing, nothing. Uh, dexterity with nothing, so it's garbage. Mana regeneration, uh, mana leech, accuracy. Hmm. Does um, anybody need um, high accuracy with mana leech? Uh, this may sell. The mana leech is okay, the accuracy is pretty high. The rest is 
more or less useless, but I'll try. As someone could use that, maybe. Uh, what about this? Crit chance with nothing. No, that's not gonna work. Crit chance, crit multi, but uh, everything is way too low. Nothing here. Nothing. Wow. This is just horrible. Oh, come on. Uh, nice spell damage and uh, together with weapon elemental damage. Those two usually don't work well together and um, there is nothing else, so never mind. 76 life, 41 lightning res. There is some strength. Uh, this will sell, but too bad that the fire res and the strength are, are just too low. Nothing to see here. Spell evasion, energy shield. Uh, don't think that can work. This is not that bad. Um, the, the leech is um, a bit low, but uh, it has the strength. This all attributes. It's actually a decent roll. 20% um, rarity. Yeah, this will definitely sell for capital of chaos. Spell damage, all attributes, crit chance with energy shield. Uh, on dexterity base on top of that, so this will definitely sell for some CI, spellcaster, uh, crit, uh, build, that's basically everything that the build needs, so some starting amulet for a build like that. Um, not good enough, life and mana region, does anybody need that? Maybe I'll try, it's a lot of life. Maybe someone will just take it because of that life and dexterity together. And for level 44, uh, yeah, probably someone will take it for leveling. Uh, what about this lightning damage? Uh, 48 dex together. Uh, I may try this for a chaos. Not good enough. Uh, nothing there either. This is also bad. Strength with nothing, so never mind. Dexterity, uh, energy shield. So, if all these rolls were higher, then maybe, but uh, not like this. Garbage, garbage, garbage. What about this? Uh, nice life reach with life. But that's not enough. Those two remaining rolls are just too bad. That life would have to be higher uh, if uh, I'd go, uh, or for me to consider trying that. Um, garbage. Nothing. Nothing. 89 life. Some mana. Mana leech. Uh, yeah, this will work. A very high life with. Uh, with decent mana leech, that will work. The weather, just these two rolls. If it had like a resistance on top of this, it'd be so much better. Ah, too bad. It was close. Spell damage and crit multi, some evasion. Hmm, can this work? The spell damage is more or less irrelevant. I'm thinking for someone who is starting like in the ranger area. Um, it gives that evasion, it gets crit multi, it gets that int. It's hard to get in that part of the tree. Uh, yeah, this uh, someone could be interested in, in this amulet. Accuracy, cast, speed, crit multi, a bit of rarity. Hmm. Strength base. Oh, maybe the crit multi isn't bad, the cast speed is good, bit of rarity. I'll try. Don't think it um, it's gonna work, but uh, I'll try. Uh, both ES rolls are good, and that's it. It's on strength base, so maybe for a chaos. Uh, average fizz, very bad lightning. Good crit multi, but that's not enough. Spell damage, gold damage, not good enough. It's bad. 
also bad. Uh, 84 life with nothing. Oh, come on. If it was at least one uh, more decent troll, not just the life. I hate it when I have to get rid of uh, 80 plus life on uh, jewelry. Nothing here. It's bad. Bad. Uh, yeah, only 24 rarity. That was not enough. And energy shield. I uh, don't think this will work. It was just that resist there that uh, was worth something that's not enough. Garbage. Garbage. Oh. Come on. If the uh, all rest roll and life roll were higher, this could have been a nice, uh, nice amulet. So what um, uh, is this gonna be if when we skip the all attributes and that life? There would be life leech on uh, energy shield to, uh, amulet. No, that doesn't work. Uh, bad, bad, bad. Spell damage, cast speed, crit multi. Mm. This is like one half is extremely bad fizz amulet, and the other half is okay ish caster amulet, and it's uh, combined together. Now, the question is if it uh, still is sellable or not. Um, the caster part is definitely better, and that uh, is spell damage, cast speed, crit multi, cold rest. So, these four rolls on a strength amulet, though it can't mastercraft anything. Mm, maybe I'll try a chaos. Uh, come on, I said I'll try a chaos. Ah, this is not good enough. Okay, so let's go through the rest, and once we are done with that, we will uh, do the transmit recipe. That's bad. Uh, maybe a chaos or two. Garbage. No, no. Uh, no. Nice dex and int, really nice. The fizz damage is average. Uh, lightning resist is average as well, but um, it has 65 uh, dex, 64 int together with the implicit. Um, that's a lot, that's really a lot. And it has the fist damage, so uh, for some Marauder, even though it doesn't have life, it still could work. It really can solve problems with Dex and Ilt, just this item. So this, uh, that will sell. 75 life with Dexterity, a bit of int. Again, this is definitely something some Marauder will want. This even has the life. So, mm, this is a couple of Chaos. Uh, double ES with some all res. There's some of the dexterity from that implicit. Um, yeah, someone starting ES will take this. Here, the second ES roll is not good enough. Uh, don't think this is gonna uh, sell. This is bad. Crit chance life. Uh -oh. For level 35. I don't think that even on level 35 this is uh, good enough. Fizz damage rarity. Uh, that's just way too low. And I think that the rarity is even a combined roll. So this is just horrible. Uh, nothing here. Wow. This is this is really super bad. Uh, Dexterity, 80 life with fist damage, bit of cold damage. This is definitely sellable. Again, some Marauder will definitely take this. That's a lot of text. And a bit of int up on top of that. So, some more chaos there. Strength life, do fire res, bit of fire damage. Mm, chaos or two. Probably chaos here as well. Oh, this one is close. Uh, level 44. Uh, someone will probably take it for leveling. 
Uh, same as this one, but those last two, they are very close to being useless. Um, what about this one? On um, uh, cit Citrine Amulet uh, base, it uh, would be nice to get some caster stats. So let's see if we can get that. Dexterity, no, not good enough. Spell damage, dexterity, crit multi, energy shield, that lightning damage, I think, even though it's um, not that bad, it's useless on this. It's for a caster. Uh, CI caster, add crit chance to this, and it's pretty damn good. A lo lots of dexterity. Yeah, this will serve for a couple of kills, definitely. It's actually quite decent. Um, Fist damage, dexterity, and there it ends. Is it enough? No. Uh, not much to see here. This is just horrible. Crit chance is okay. All attributes are okay. Evasion is useless. A bit of mana regen. Some mana. Maybe, maybe like two chaos. Fire damage, crit chance. No, everything is just too low. Garbage. Fist damage, energy shield, uh, mana leech. Maybe some hybrid build, but I don't think so. I'll probably try for a chaos because of that mana leech, but uh, don't really think this can ever sell. Uh, this is bad. Mm, this is bad as well. Dexterity, all attributes, crit multi, armor, evasion. Uh, no, this doesn't work. Fist, crit chance, life, life, leech. That's a bit better, just uh, those rolls are uh, a bit too low. Except that uh, fist damage that is good. But uh, that's sellable. This is not. This is, this is horrible. Uh, spell damage, dexterity, crit chance, mana, energy shield. If that spell damage was at least like 18%, this would be a decent amulet. But um, it's just a 3% roll. It's not even worth trying. Uh, probably is for like a chaos spell. <laughs> yeah, that uh, uh, roll on that spell damage just uh, destroyed the amulet. Nothing to see there or here. Uh, 89 life, dexterity, call damage. This will sell most likely because of that life. But that's basically all there is. But for level 43, 89 life. That's actually not bad. What's here? Cast speed, energy shield, ORS with some dexterity. Um. This may sell. This probably will sell. Life energy shield. Uh, not good enough. Spell damage dexterity. Nope. Not enough. Useless. Oh, this could sell. It's um, a lot of mana regen. It's together 78 mana regen uh, with decent energy shield. Double energy shield roll. Uh, nothing super amazing, but that will sell. Uh, here, this is where it is. That's not gonna sell. Garbage. Fire, lightning, energy shield. Nope. Nothing to see here. Nothing to see here. Uh, this is garbage as well. 51 mana region with nothing else. So never mind. And now we have um, all the Enix, uh, Onyx amulets. Uh, garbage. Garbage. Weapon element damage, nothing else. Fire damage, gun speed, grit chance, mana. So it's either fire damage, uh, crit chance, and mana, or cast speed, grit chance, and mana. The cast speed and fire damage won't work together, but on Onyx base, this could sell. Uh, crit chance, nope, that was bad. Uh, this started pretty well. Uh, that accuracy and crit chance are good, but the rest, look at the rest. So, never mind. Can this sell maybe just for the accuracy and crit chance? 
because it's, because it's Onyx amulet. Uh, maybe I could try to get a chaos for this or two. I'll probably will. Um, this is better. Lightning damage. Uh, both rolls are average, but at least it's some kind of theme. Uh, they're both lightning. 77 life is okay, 10 all rest is acceptable, 45 fires is good, and the 60 uh, or 0.62 uh, life leech um, can work as well. Mm, this is not bad. This is definitely a couple of chaos. That was bad. This one is bad. Uh, not good enough. Nothing. Nothing here. Accuracy. No. Nothing there. Nothing here either. Nope. Nope. Wow. Six persons sp spell damage. Yeah, that can't work. Nothing. Cold damage, lightning damage, crit multi. Nope. Not good enough. Uh, can't speed crit chance. This is basically fire damage, lightning res uh, lightning damage, crit chance, and mana leech. The cast speed here is wasted roll. But um, even with that, this will sell. Too bad that the mana leech isn't higher. But it's two decent, uh, decent uh, elemental rolls with good crit chance. And this is sellable. Again, couple of chaos. Um, Armor evasion, rarity. Nope, this is not good enough. Uh, garbage. All attributes, cast speed. I don't think, even though that's all, uh, like 36 all attributes, there's basically nothing else. So, one, one cell, and uh, this is simply bad. Okay. So all we need to do now is um, come on, do some vendor recipes to get a few more rolls, and that will be all for this you. video. Ah, uh, come on, what do I want to do? Let's combine these two and get some maybe a gate amulets. This is the reason why it doesn't work. Both um, these uh, amulets are called Entropy Charms. And if you sell two um, uh, items with the same name, uh, you get the Orb of Chance. So I will have to get different, uh, or one of them, have, uh, while I had to swap to get that Agate amulet. Okay, more transmutes. How many do we have left? Uh, eight. Okay. This should be enough. Three. 
One, two, three. Good. Um, let's throw these remaining amulets to the uh, regal tab and we can identify everything and go through the last 20 rolls. Oh, let's see. Cold damage, bit of life, no, that's bad. Not good enough. Strength cold. It's a lot of strength on this, maybe for some. Yes, build. This could work. I'll probably try chaos. Uh, what about this? Nope. Crit chance rarity. Nope. Doesn't work. 85 life with dexterity. That's all this is and because it can't mastercraft anything it probably won't be enough oh no oh, just not enough spell damage with nothing so it's not enough uh, nothing there nothing here 74 life nope this is a bit better. It's a lot of int. If the if that all attributes roll is higher, that would be a decent amulet. But it's still gonna sell. Uh, what do we have uh, here? Very nice accuracy, average uh, multiplier, nice cold rest, bit of evasion. This is sellable. Uh, garbage, lightning damage, crit chance, not enough. Crit chance, mana, mana regeneration. A mana regeneration is okay, decent uh, or very nice cold dress actually. Uh, some crit chance, maybe a chaos. Uh, not much to see here or here. Dexterity crit multi. It has the mana leech, so maybe because of that uh, mana leech, this could sell. Uh, I really doubt it, but I'll try. And what about this one? Energy shield did nothing. Yeah, that's basically what it is. So, nothing interesting there either. Okay, so, uh, I can't say that um, this was an amazing, uh, amazing session. Uh, again, with the, the current ratios, we invested how many? 288. Um, Alks, which is uh, like uh, a bit less than three exalts, and we should be able to get uh, that back when we add the value of uh, what we're gonna get from the regular recipe. We will get that back definitely. There are some rolls that will sell over 10 chaos, but uh, yeah, not that good. Uh, though there are sometimes are sessions where uh, you just get basically back what you invest and uh, uh, that's it. Though when you consider what we got in those previous sessions, I really really like this amulet. It's uh, one of the best amulets that's out there now. Or maybe even the best one. I've tried to look for amulets and uh, there is nothing like this around uh, yet. So yeah, we can't get uh, a roll like this every time. Uh, but of course, I'll try again in the next video, in the next crafting session, and I hope I hope you'll join me for that again. And until then, have a good time. And bye bye.